Yeah, 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 y'all. Here I come again. Start this video up. And there we are. I'm just waiting for my guests. What's up, everybody? Once again, Jay Tronius. Gabbing with the governor. Yeah, there I am. There I am. Hot diggity damn. And I am just waiting on my new guest. This is episode five with my partner G Nice about to get on here. Hope y'all staying blessed out there as always. We just hit him up here. Get this thing going. Yeah, man. Let's see, let's see here. Yeah, eventually, y'all, you know, these are, this is the first run of these, you know, we're going to keep growing as time goes on. You know, I appreciate your patience as we wait for our guests to come in. Eventually, you know, we will get our editing game on lock and add some glitter and glam to this shit, but I like the raw energy of this, you know, putting shit on the spot and just rolling with it, man. I've been having a great time so far with these interviews, man. So all of you that I'm interviewing, if you got people that you think I should interview, send them my way, man. The more the merrier, man. I'm trying to get my episode game up, you know what I'm saying? And we're just waiting to just hit G-Nice up. We're just waiting for him to get online. Well, listen, we're going to get this thing popping. Glow trotting on the video, you did with the governor. Boom, 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 boom. That buster. Oh, here we go, y'all. We're going live. Here we go. Let's get it. G nice. Just wait on him. Hey, connect. Hey, there he is. Hey, you gotta connect your audio. You see the option? We gotta get your audio going. I can see you, but I can't hear you. Yep, we gotta get. You gotta get. There's, there's something on there. You gotta look and see. Get your microphone going. There he is, it's connecting audio now. There we go. Yo, yo, yo. Be nice is speaking, okay. Yeah, I can hear you now. Now we gotta get that video back on there. We're all the way live. Okay, hold on. All right, boom, I flash back, here we go. There it is, there it is. What's going on, partner, what's going down? And call it, man, just over here in the studio trying to work on some stuff in this quarantine. You know, keep saying before getting cabin fever. <laughs> I hear you. I hear you, man. Welcome to my show, man. My, this is Jay Tronius. You Jay are now, you now govern, you know, you gabbing with the governor, the governor yep. of the galaxy. Man, uh -huh. it, you know, we. this is actually our first time speaking like this, period. Absolutely. Right, yo, you a beast musician, man. I love your music too, man. I'm telling yeah, you. I appreciate that, man. You know, our, our connection is, of course, the, your wonderful sister. Right, that's my baby. My yeah, heart is man. I met her years ago in Boston, and we were right. instant homies, man. Beautiful spirit, beautiful being, man. And she is. She She's always wonderful. spoke highly of you. So here we are now, and we Thank connect God. the dots. You dig? Word, man. Now, for the rest of the world, man, tell them who you are, where you're from, and what you're about, man. Hey, what's good, world? It's your boy, G-Nice, hip-hop and soul, you know what I'm saying? Out of Connecticut, you know what I'm saying? I'm out here, you know, I have two bands that I run with, which is Family Affair and uh, and Mike Childs, you know what I'm saying, the musical movement. So, you know, I'm out here, uh, you know, doing music and also putting out original music, you know, and um, just trying to uh, make a difference in the world, you know what I'm saying? So. All I ever been about, you know what I'm saying, and actually have something to say, you know. Now, who is who is this? Uh, who is this uh, monster you got with you? This right my now? little, 
this is my grandson right here. He he want he he want to he said he want to he wanted to jump up in it because he want he was in a walker. <laughs> He's just starting to run right now, so he was in the walker looking at me when I'm in the studio. So I just I snatched him up. I'm like, let me keep him quiet with me real quick. <laughs> well, well, hello to you. How you? Hello to you, little one. Hello to you. King, say say king, say hey. yo. Man, now, okay, now you're Connecticut-based and you've been doing music. Tell us a little bit about your music journey, man. Start us from the beginning and move us into the now. Yeah, man, um, I started, you know, I come from a real um, uh, real well-aligned musical family, you know, uh, that have been doing music on the scene for like 50, over 60 years plus, you know what I'm saying? Stemming all down from all different uh, generations in my family, actually. Yeah. And then, um, you know, I try to sum it up a little bit, you know, I don't want to go crazy, but... You know what I'm saying? Um, I got, you know, I have some my cousins right now um, that are also doing music that I, I I'm in a, that are in my band as well. That I want is my uh, my MD, my musical director. Um, and you know, and we um, and I'm just like putting out albums and LPs. I have a lot of, you know, history and music. You know, um, I've always rapped and sang since I was, you know, at a young age. And, you know what I'm saying? And we forever young, so we still, you know, we uh. We, you know, we still just trying to, you know, make a difference. You know what I'm saying? My whole family is still, you know, aligned in the music and they doing their thing out here. So, nice. you know, I'm just trying to be one of those components, you know what I'm saying? And, and put my, my spin on it, you know? <laughs> so so it's, it's fair enough to say that it's a family legacy thing. Yeah, it is. We, and we also, you know, we all do individual things as well, but you know what I'm saying? We, uh, you know, we do support each other as a family, you know what I'm saying? Because we're all... You know, we've all been blessed, thank God, with, you know, um, some musical gifts, you know. So it's just, you know, an honor to, to be able to um, use our gifts to, you know what I'm saying, influence people. And so now we're just at a level where me and my sister, we always had a group, you know what I'm saying? It was G and V. Yeah. So, you know, it was, it's because my birth name, is, they, they call me G Nice, but my birth name is Gerard. So that's where the G came from. And uh, G and Veronica, V for Veronica. So it was G and V. Yeah. But, uh, so what we're gonna do, you know, we'll be getting what's just on the arm right there. Ah, you know, uh, uh, you know, but we're getting back to some. Um, you know, we used to be a group back in the day as well, and um, tour with Shamari. Um, you know, do stuff with the uh, the group Shamari that was also signed, which is my cousins. And um, you know, then we had a, our own individual group, and now you know we're gonna get back to some of that stuff that we've been, you know, we've been we we did back in the day, you know. Um, now so we're just trying to you know do that individually, you know drop mixtapes and drop, you know, um, singles and, you know, EPs and, you know, we're working on stuff right now. So, yeah, man, it's just a great opportunity, you know, like to be able to work with her still after all these years, you know, we're so compassionate about it, you know? Nice. Nice. So, and, and, uh, and so, you know, so when did you know that music was your thing? When, did, did you have, was it an epiphany moment? Like, then, was it a time you're like, man, this is really what I love to do? Well, I always see my father and his bands and stuff playing, you know, since a young age, you know, me and my sisters and stuff like that. We always seen them, you know, rehearsing and playing and they, they opened up for every, we all opened up for so many majors in the world. Like you, you name it, you know, Charlie Wilson, we opened up for everybody. So my, you know, my father and then back in the day, you know, they had a group, which was very, you know, a very successful group back in the day um, called the Langley Five and, you know, and they thrive out of New Haven, Connecticut, you know what I'm saying? And they were amazing. So just, you know, me me growing up around that, you know, and me and my sister seeing that, and it always made us want to sing. We were always singing, but I always loved rapping too. You know, I always loved, I loved hip hop, you know what I'm saying? So I just kind of like fell into that and, um, you know, and still sang, of course, you know what I'm saying? But uh, I just, I don't know, I was just, you know, I got in my own head, I guess, you know, because it was, it was sometimes where, you know, when I was like seven years old, I started really rapping like, yeah. Uh, writing, writing stuff. My mother let me write out the, the bathroom uh, rules in a rap. <laughs> so, you know, I always had a passion for music, you know what I'm saying? Even though I was active in sports and all different other types of stuff, but you know what I'm saying? Like, that was my, that was always my passion. I've always wanted to do music. And, yeah. You know, and, and then being around my cousins and them like really pushing us and being so amazing musicians and producers and singers and it's just amazing. So it just, you know, it just kept on pushing me and I just never stopped. Like, you know, that's fly. That's fly. Now, do you um produce all your stuff or do you work with other producers as well? I, well, that's I do both. I actually um, I haven't been producing tracks in a while, but I do get production from my cousin as well, the MD. Um, he, he sends me tracks. I have other various producers that I work with, like Chris Jones and a bunch of 
like amazing producers, you know what I'm saying? And both of my cousins actually, um, uh, uh, Rasan and, 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 and Tony, they, they give me tracks and, you know, we just build back and forth. And I also work with a lot of new producers too. And um, a couple of known producers that are in the industry, I actually have a couple of uh, tracks on my um, record, on my album of, you know, just various uh, uh, producers. You know what I'm saying? Some have two tracks or three tracks, but you know. Word. I, I love to work with, you know, cast that's, you know, um, you know what I'm saying, came from where I came from basically and still trying to climb. Like, so that's like my, you know, I want to have those cats on my stuff, you know, like, yeah. I, and and they're, they're just raw, you know, like raw, you, you know, you know the hip hop scene, bro. I know you're engulfed in this music. I can feel it when you spit and you do your songs and stuff. Yeah, man. So I know. I know, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just like you could tell certain people that are just so passionate about what they do that you could just feel the vibe as soon as they walk in the room. You know what I'm saying? Like, I tell so, people all the time, man, I tell people I am music. But I say that all the time, Charles. <laughs> That's what I yeah, tell I people. You know, you're talking to music right now. Thanks. I feel you, bro. Yeah. I say that same thing. I say, yo, um, you know, because my my, uh, my cousin was saying, he's like, yo, you can say what you want to say. I'm like, look, I said, look, I feel like no one in the world loves music more than me. <laughs> you know, yeah. but it's just, you know, it's such a therapeutic thing, you know, like, look at what we're going through right now in this, in this, in this, in this terrible you know, pandemic, you know, this crazy stuff going on with the virus. And, you know, like, you know, we're quarantined. So which, you know, it's really hard for a lot of people that suffer depressions or, or, or need to get out the house because, you know, they're escaping other people. You know, you know what I'm saying. I don't want to get yeah. too crazy about it, but like, you know, like right now is a real good time to like do music and build and write and create something that nobody in the world ever did. Like you, everybody every day has that opportunity. So I just feel like it's the best time right now. You know? I tell people right now, man, you know, you got to, everybody has to really find out how to be an alchemist to turn the bullshit into cool shit. Where, that's my big thing right now is like and, and that's even how this started man you know i've been having people telling me for years i should have been doing a, a podcast or some yeah. kind of show or something and, and i was like it, it really hit me during these times i'm like man this is going to be good for me to keep my mind occupied and right. to other people and to pull it all together everybody right. I, I, i've ran across in my journey or i've heard about and just continually do this to where every, you know, and it puts it all in, in, in one planet. Yeah. That's, a, that's right, little bro. That's right, little man. Right, right there. The page, tell him, Chase. Say, we coming. Say, we coming. Yeah, man. You know, it, it, it's time, you know, when it, when, you know, when, and everybody's back's against the wall, I think for us creative people, it's, it's our time to really bring yeah, a lot yeah. of light and love to the situation. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Because this is the best time, like, use that energy. I mean, even if you are going through, you know, any type of mental conditions or, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, because I've suffered depression plenty of times. I'm not afraid to admit that. Like, yeah. like I, use, I use that to, you know, try to channel, you know, other ways to think and, and, and you know, and create. Mm -hmm. And that'll help you escape. I'm telling you, like, I tell people all the time, like, you know, never throw away your gift to write or to record music you know because i feel like music is so therapeutic you know it can save lives man like i swear people have told me that some of my songs like uh, one of my remixes a long time ago a few people was like yo i listened to that and it saved my life she nice and i'm like word you know what i'm saying and so it's like yo i was alive to create something that saved someone's life that's wow. it that's it man like i was like, what you know so at the end of the day it's like yo that's just you just gotta be you just gotta be compassionate about you know what it is that you're doing. People will feel it, you know. Exactly. This little man singing right now. He ready to yeah, jump on the is. track he right now. He going in. Hold on. I'm gonna try to. Hold on. Give me two seconds. I'm gonna try to um, put him in the walker real quick right here. Hold on. <laughs> oh, baby. What did you say to them? What they said to you? He was alive. He was alive. All right, stay right here, baby. Real quick. I'll be right. Yeah, man. <laughs> I love the kids, man. I love. I, I got yeah, a seventeen-year-old daughter, man. I love the kids, man. Hear you, man. I, I got a few myself, man. So yeah, I tell you, man. So tell me this. So tell tell me the rest of the world, social media wise, website wise, email, whatever. Give them whatever way we can get to you to to come into oh, your yeah. world. 
Absolutely. Thank you for that, too. Um, yeah, if you guys want to reach me on Instagram, you can hit me on The Real G Nice. I'm uh, The Real G Nice on Twitter. I, 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 I usually have that on all social media platforms. Um, but if you want to hit me on Facebook, it's G Nice uh, Langley. I have the band booking page there as well. Um, so um, also Event Moon is a, another app that me and my company I work for right now, and I'm an ambassador of them. Um, so um, that's like an ultimate event finder app. Um, you can you think it's downloadable too, and it'll tell you where all my shows are and stuff like that too. So um, if if anybody wants to uh, reach me through uh, via show or or um, music, you could type in G Nice on all digital platforms, and you and my music is up there as well. Yeah. Uh, Nice. Now tell us, man. I'm, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get two, two, two major questions with you. Number uh -huh. one. Yeah. Number one, I, and I'm asking this to everybody. Uh -huh. It's all said and done. What is your? What do you want your legacy? What legacy do you want to leave behind with this? That's a good one. Um, uh, I just wanted to leave a, a a legacy of basically like I was that guy that wanted to share his gifts with the world, you know, and teach people stuff to be better than me. You know what I'm saying? And so my legacy really is just like, you know, my work and I want, you know, I want to leave something, you know, for my kids and make sure that they, you know, that they know, uh, you know, and they do know, um, and my family as well. Um, and also my, you know, my, my close friends and, and uh, fans and stuff like that, they know I'm real compassionate. <laughs> And he's real compassionate right now. Hey, it's uh, all good. It's uh, all to the good. Thank you, baby. Hold on. You know, and, and you know, and just you know, that's the legacy I want to leave behind. That I tried to, you know, you know, be, you know, a guide, a guidance to other, to others, you know, and use my work to possibly inspire you, like some of my songs have saved people. That's it. Know, that's so, it. Yeah, yeah. Man, that's beautiful, man. And hey, right. to somebody that's just starting out, to to the youth. Uh huh. What do you want to tell them? What what advice can you give to them when they're just when they start they're starting out their little their little journey? Um. Well, I would say to the youth, definitely. I'm sorry about that. Um, I would say to the youth, basically, like you know, follow your dreams. Don't let anybody tell you that you know that you're not good enough or that you can't be you know be what you want to be because you know God all gave us gifts. You know whether you you know whether you you know you you. You know, you have gifts or not, like, like you feel, you know, you can still create. You know, God gave us these beautiful brains and, and, you know, and these ideas to go and shoot and do, you know. So I'm just saying, like, to all the youth, basically, like, you know, keep pushing, keep striving, to, um, you know, and if you're compassionate about music, push music, you know. But I do say, you know, stay in school, finish school, get your education because, you know, having an education is a good thing as well. So, but if you have a passion, follow it, you know. And to get people around you that follow your passion as well, you know, and want to push you and, you know, and, and I feel like that, you know, that's, that's what, you know, the youth, because I work with youth right now. I'm a, I, I teach general music uh, for fifth and sixth grade. Nice. You know what I'm so I'm always trying to, you know, put that out there to the kids. Like, look, these are the things that, you know, Mr. Langley did. I don't want y'all doing that. They're like, you know, because I have tattoos on my face, my hands, my neck. You know, and the kids are like, look, I want some tattoos on my face. I'm like, no, don't do that because at the end of, end of the day, you know, you're kind of setting a roadblock for yourself too because, you know, in the corporate world because, you know, you possibly can, you know, you know, when you want to get, a, you know, to a certain success or, you know, like me, I'm already done. <laughs> but, I mean, once you get to a certain, you know, plateau or success in life and, you, you know, and, and you're straight, then you can do stuff like that. I feel like, but before that, you know, it's a good thing to be able to push the youth and let them know, like, yo, look, you know, like my son right now, he's a musician. And all my, you know, my children are musicians, but, you know, my son is an amazing singer. And, you know, I want to push him to, you know, of course, finish school, you know, and do those things first, of course. But also, you know, he really loves music. And, you know, I'm going to push his career. The kid is an amazing singer. Like, nice. you know, so it's like, you know, that's all I really, you know, my whole me message, my whole legacy is to just, you know, is to inspire other people and let them know, like, yo, we can do this, we can make this, man. You know, God, that's put, about. God put us all here for a reason, brother. Real you know, talk, real look talk. Look how we put us together, you know? That's real. That's <laughs> and that's real. a blessing. I thank you for giving me the opportunity to share this stuff. Hey, man, hey, this is what it's all about, man. You know, my, my new mantra right now, I'm in a group right now called Sons of the Sun. And okay. my new mantra with that is, I will become like the sun and shine uh -huh. on everyone. 
That's crazy. I just used that bar in the song I just sent Fathom, not even er ten, like 20 minutes ago. Because that's <laughs> what it's about, man. We're all stars. Yeah, sunshine and sunshine. That's crazy. Yeah, wow. man. The universal That's alignment cool, is real right now, man. And, oh, yeah. and I thank you. I thank you for getting on my show today. Of course, and, uh, I tell, tell, tell them you. one more time. Tell them one more time how we how we get into your how we get in touch with you. How do we check you out? Yeah, make sure if you try, uh, try to get at me and my music, you can um, type in G Nice on all digital streaming platforms right now, or you can also to find me. You can type in Real G Nice on Instagram. I'm up there on Twitter. Also, you know what I'm saying, on uh, Facebook, if you want to book me or the bands, you can see uh, G Nice Langley, and I'm up there on Facebook, too, as well. My dude, my so, dude, Thank man. you so much, hey, man. That's what's up, man. Nothing but love and life from Texas and beyond, brother. Ooh, hey, this is Jay Trophy and y'all. Y'all were gabbing with the governor with G Nice. Yes. Hey, the governor. Be blessed. Be blessed, too, man. man. And turn hey. the bullshit into cool shit, y'all. What? That's right. You already know. That's, That's I heard that. Be good, fam. Be good. All right, good brother. Please, peace, peace. peace.